So let's have a look at the entries in the detection system within side network sims. So it uses the Snort IDS engine. So we bring up Toolkit. Just takes a little minute to load. And within here we have Snort. And just to sh the Snort's output goes into a file called alert.idea. So we can see here currently uh, this file is, is empty. So what we'll do is we'll load up some rules. So if we load ICMP rules, it's a very simple rule. All it really does is detect that uh, ICMP is being used by detecting this payload. Okay, so we'll, we'll capture it on the wireless interface. So Snort is now running. And so what we'll do is we'll just ping an external site. Okay, so now we go here and we can view our alert file. And we can see here, here are our four echoes. One, two, three, four. Okay, so let's stop the capture. We can also view our art file, which is empty just now. I will delete the file. We can see it's empty again. Now what we'll do is we'll open up one with sin rules. So this will detect when we when we make any connections that is a sin flag set for the TCP packet. Okay, so we'll just load up a browser window. And here we can see it detected four three send packets. There's the flags that detected and this is the source machine and this is the destination so hopefully when we do a lookup on this we should find that this should resolve to google yeah, it's difficult to detect it but this is the the google site okay so we can use uh, not to actually detect sins and you can see here we're still receiving sins because the connection is actually still open okay so this shows an example of using snort the rule itself is fairly simple we can see here that we're detecting the sin, the sin flag